For everyone living between Florida and Texas, it's getting close to time to plant your potatoes. Potatoes are a good crop. They're easy to grow. They grow just about anywhere as long as you don't have a lot of rocks or roots in the soil. That whenever the potato starts to grow, it needs to be able to grow easily. That you can plant them in the early spring, like around mid to late February, and not have to worry about frost or freeze because the potato plants seem to be pretty resistant to cold temperatures. And what you do is you just go down to the local feed and fertilizer store. These were bought a couple of weeks ago. They've been in a, in a bag. And you just take and find the eyes as they're starting to come off of the potato. Whenever you're looking at these seed potatoes, what you want to do is look for the sprouts. These little eyes coming off of them. That's going to be the potato plant. Just take and cut a good chunk of it like that. And whenever you plant it, you just take and put it in the soil just like that. But we'll go over planting the potatoes later. All we're doing now is just cutting them. And we're going to let them dry overnight and plant them tomorrow. Now you can buy regular potatoes from the store and use them as seed potatoes. But, but, what will happen, see that eye right there? That's what you want. See this has got another one starting right there. But, okay, now here's the kicker. There's a lot of times they will spray those potatoes in the stores with a coating to stop them from sprouting. So you can buy regular potatoes from the store and use them as seed potato. But it's going to take a little bit longer. See, that one there only has one eye on it. So we're going to cut this potato in half. Like that. And then whenever we plant it, we'll plant that eye straight down and just plant that down like that. And hopefully something will sprout off of that after it's in the ground. And the way that you plant these is you plant them about three to four inches deep. Then as the top of the plant starts to grow, you take and you hoe up some soil around the plant. See how that one there's got two eyes on it? And there's another one right there. So all I'm going to do is I'm just going to take and split that across there like that. Plant that in the soil. Just like that with that eye pointing up. Now the really neat thing about potatoes is that you, once they're harvested, you keep them out of sunlight. If you, if you harvest them and let them stay in the sunlight, they'll turn green. The green is some type of toxin. I don't remember the exact name right now. But... You want to keep the potatoes like in between layers of straw once they're harvested. And if you keep them cool and dry, they will stay good for months. Literally, literally months. That's what makes them such a great crop to have around. So that you plant them right now, it'll take them four, five, six months to get ready to harvest. And then once they are, once you harvest them, if you store them properly, They'll stay good for several months. And if any of them are still good, or if you haven't eaten all of them, by the time it comes ready to plant your next harvest, you just take the potatoes that you planted and grew last year, put them in the ground again, and grow you another batch. Potatoes can be harvested at any time during the growth phase, so that in three or four months, if we decide we wanted some baby potatoes to go in a stew, we can go out there and dig around the potato plant harvest the baby potatoes and then put them into a stew and then leave the plant intact where it'll keep growing. See that eye right there? That's what we're looking for. Or you could even just plant that whole potato in the ground and it'll grow. I might have to go to the feed store and get me some more. Like that right there. See that eye? We'll put the we'll till up the soil, spread the fertilizer, put that in the ground with that eye pointing up, and then cover it up with soil. Now whenever we plant these, we're gonna plant them about three feet apart or one good long pace so that the potatoes have room to grow inside the ground around them. 
and that's what they look like. You just take and cut them, and you're looking for that eye right there, and that's the start of the plant. I Meaning this potato is getting ready to start growing.